up you guys welcome back to my channel my name is Abby if you are new if you are new you should definitely go down below and click that subscribe button because all we got is good hair and good content over here sis okay so today I decided that I wanted to try this trend that is kind of old now but still kind of new to me I went ahead on Amazon and I bought this wand curling heatless curl thing and I've been dying to try it for a couple of months, but your girl's been rocking braids with the travel and everything going on. But I think it's finally time. So I'm going to be trying this heatless curl method. Honestly, I just want to try it out and show you all what your hair could probably look like if you have a similar texture to mine. I already went ahead and blow dried my hair. It's looking a little stiff right now, but I washed it last night and this morning I decided let me blow dry it to see if it works. The only product that I have in my hair currently is the Main Choice H2O Hydration Therapy Intense Nourishing Leave-In Conditioner. If you guys haven't checked out that video where I shared all the details on this entire line, you should definitely check that out. And I'm going to actually be applying a little bit more when I start actually going in with this one thing and curling my actual hair. I'm going back in my Amazon to see how much I paid for this. Because I did get it on Amazon. I didn't get it from any specific brand just because I just wanted to try it out real quick. And honestly, Amazon is sometimes a lot cheaper. Okay, here we go. I got this, and I'll link it in the description box below, but I got this one from Amazon. It's called the Batood Heatless Curling Rod Headband. I paid $12.99, okay? It comes in different colors if you want to try different colors, if you want to be cute while you sleep. But I just chose the black one. It comes with the actual rod. It has a clip and then it has two satin scrunchies to help you achieve the look. So let's hop right into it. I'm not gonna ramble any longer. Actually run my comb through, make sure we're looking kind of decent over here. I've actually watched other videos of other natural hair influencers do this look. And the main concern, which is also my concern, is the fact that it's a split down the middle and the back of my hair is probably not gonna look as good as the front but i'm willing to take that risk since it is my first time i took some of the product and i'm just gonna apply this throughout the entire section might as well do it on both sides huh okay all right so i'm gonna take this wand and i want to kind of even so boom i actually want to put this side away because i feel like it's gonna start reverting now that i added product so let me just okay I feel like this is gonna be the most difficult part so let me focus real quick so let me go okay okay grab another piece I'm trying to do it kind of tight so the curl can actually form. I hope I'm doing this right. Oh, wait, hold it there. Did I do that correctly? I don't know. I'm just gonna pray. I don't know, y'all. Okay, I'm gonna try this again. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Bring that around. I'm gonna zoom y'all in. Fourth piece. Is that correct? Jesus, Abigail. I don't feel like it's tight enough up here. <sighs> okay, one second. I'm going to go try to do this in the bathroom mirror. One second. try this next side this is a mission okay if you are thinking about doing this and it's your first time 
give yourself some grace throughout this process because I was about to get really frustrated, but I figured it out, I think. For my hair, I've realized that I just have to work in a lot smaller pieces. And what I'm doing is also, when I reach like this area right here, and I'll show you guys what I mean in a second, but when I reach this area here, instead of only grabbing from here, I start grabbing from hairs in the middle area so that these can get some curls too. So I start off here. Grab my second piece. Boom. Okay, right here is where I start grabbing. Instead of just grabbing here, I'm gonna grab from here. So I'm grabbing from this section, right? And I'm just gonna split that and bring it and then give it a good twist and then repeat so really I'm grabbing from here I'm taking a piece twist What a mission! <laughs> oh my gosh! So, this is what the front looks like. It looks a lot tighter than when I initially started. I'm really praying and hoping that this works. I'm really praying and hoping because I feel like the results are going to look so bomb. Here's the back. The overthinker in me really wants to apply some sort of setting mousse to this just to make sure that my hair really gets to last after I take this thing out so hold on let me figure out which product I want to use I found this mousse definition texture foam from the dough um, I had it stashed up in my products so I'm just gonna take and I'm just gonna I don't know guys what I think I'm gonna do is sit under the hooded dryer while well, I actually have like a little dryer, blow dryer piece. I'm gonna sit under some heat, let this dry, and then I'm gonna rock it like this for the rest of the day. And later or tomorrow, I'll be back to share my final results with you guys. I'm really excited. I hope you guys are too. I'm really excited. Okay. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it the way they've been doing it. Must have did this really tight. What's going on? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna do one side. <laughs> I feel like it worked. I'm so excited okay 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 let's see let's see let's see I love the fact that we have curls there are actual curls up in here y'all oh my gosh oh my goodness I'm being so gentle I should have put some oil in my hands but I was just too excited I love the fact that we have curls okay that's the main thing for me I thought we was gonna have some little short little curls, but I actually have some what can be some possible volume up in here. I wanna go ahead and style my hair. I think I'm gonna do it off camera just so that I won't mess anything up. But this is the front. It looks very shiny and I feel like my hair highlights give it a little bit more definition and depth. I'm really loving that. Here's the back. 
I'm going to try to fix this little divide that we have going on here because I definitely don't like that. Okay, be right back. I don't think y'all are ready for me. I don't. Because it's giving, okay? It is giving. It's giving. I feel grown and sexy. I feel like I could walk into the room right now and get like 10 different business partnerships. I don't know. I don't know what I, I don't know what I can get, but I'm gonna get some. Do y'all see what I see? <sighs> we got the back going on. I try my best to just like run my fingers through here to create some volume and for that line not to be so harsh. It was giving side part, so I was like, okay, you know, let's give it side part. Like, I don't have the words. I don't have the words. I'm feeling myself. That I will say. I am feeling myself because how is it that this and a little bit of product gave me this? No me aguanto. I can't stand myself right now because I'm giving. <laughs> I'm feeling myself, okay? I'm feeling myself. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I'm really excited. I love this. I'm going to be doing this time and time again. Probably not for the summer because it'll be getting hot and edges be sweating. But definitely something that I will try again closer to the fall and the winter times when my hair will actually stay in this form. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And of course, I will see you guys in my next video.